was born and raised in an auction house in Argentina that belonged to my family. This is my passion and I wanted to run a business of contemporary art. Barro is an Argentinian art gallery. It was founded in November of 2014. We represent 15 artists around the world, mostly Argentinian artists. We decided to open after eight years of gallery in New York. We believe this is the center of the world in the art market. And we strongly believe that being here with the gallery, we can communicate with our colleagues, artists, institutions, directors. This place is amazing and is growing day by day. We choose Seaport because this is one of the historical neighborhoods in New York. After COVID, many business left this place. They make an opportunity to people to come and live here in the neighborhood, so it's changing. There's no more a financial neighborhood. Many galleries are arriving here. You have new projects that are coming. It's very close to the river, like our gallery in Buenos Aires. We love La Boca, we love Seaport, we love the, the river. This year we are presenting in Fritz, New York, a solo project of Monica Giron called Ajuar para el Conquistador or Trousseau for the Conqueror. It's a set of merino wool pieces of clothing like pullovers, leggings, gloves and scrap made for birds. This series was inspired in Monica's Giron childhood where she grew up in Bariloche, is the south of Argentina, La Paragonia, where there was a lot of birds or another kind of birds that you don't found in the other places of Argentina. Monica Giron is one of the most important Argentinian artists from the 90s. She's a conceptualism artist, works with sculptures, paintings, textiles, and she's also a very important teacher for contemporary artists. Monica's works connects us in a sensitive and a sensible way to help us to understand the rapid changes in the world today. We just opened this exhibition of Marcelo Pombo, one of the most influential artists from the 90s in Argentina. This exhibition is called Artisanal Conceptualism Starting Point. The textiles are made of povera elements that he bought in cheap markets. And these those drawings are the gay life in Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo remember that in Brazil they also had a dictatorship government and Marcelo Pombo was fighting for the gay rights. In Argentina we have long history of good art since the 40s with concrete art and the 60s with conceptualism artists like Marta Minujín that is showing at MoMA. So I believe that institutions are taking note about this. And talking about contemporary art, we strongly believe that this is the time for Barro to show the quality of the artists we have in New York, in the main capital of the art world. <laughs>